Okay, part one. We are going to be tackling right now measures 31 to 60. So measure 31 starts at the bottom of page four with the words black my boots and make them shine. Okay, we're going to have a lot of fun with our B's with our diction right in that one. Um, turn to the next page, which would be page five. And then find page, the bottom of page five, measure 53. This is actually the new stuff. The rest of this section is mostly stuff we've already done before. So we're going to tackle the new stuff first and then put it together with measure with the rest of the section. Okay. All right. I'm really excited because you've almost learned the entire song. Seriously, you have. Okay. So we're going to start bottom of page five, measure 53 with there's a gal in Baltimore. Okay. So I'm going to sing the phrase. And remember, um, and then I'm going to ask you to sing it with me. I'm going to demonstrate first, and then I want you to sing it with me. Now, all of this, we want to make sure our posture is, is nice and tall. Our spine is nice and tall, so check your posture right now. And make sure when we're breathing, we're breathing 360 degrees all the way around. That means we're not breathing up like this. We're breathing from low down in our belly, and we're even feeling the back expand right back here. If you put your hands right here around your rib cage like this, and then you breathe deep and try and push those hands out, that's that 360 degree breathing that we want all the way around here. Okay? So let's start measure 53. So these four measures right here goes like this. Let me make sure I have an A because <laughs> I talk too much. There's a gun. Okay, so breathe nice and tall and lift that soft palate at the back of that mouth so we have lots of space. There's, watch, listen, and then repeat with me. Okay, listen. There's a girl in Baltimore, little eyes a chain. Okay, now let's crescendo just a little bit, get a little bit louder at Baltimore, little eyes a Jane. Okay, say this with me. There's a gal in Baltimore, little eyes a Jane. Ready, go. There's a girl in, there's a gal. Here we go. There's a gal in Baltimore, little eyes a Jane. So we're just doing a little crescendo, a little get louder at the top of page six. Sounds like this. Listen, and then we'll do it together. There's a gal in Baltimore, little eyes a Jane. Ready? Try that. Ready? Breathe. There's a gal in Baltimore, little eyes a Jane. Good. Do that one more time. Ready? Breathe with me. There's a gal in Baltimore, little eyes a Jane. Good. Next phrase, top of page six, starts with silver door plate on her door. Sounds like this. Silver door plate on her door, little eyes a chain. And again, just a little grow, a little crescendo on door. Again, silver door plate, sounds like this. Silver door plate on her door, little eyes a chain. Okay, try that one with me. Ready? Go. Silver door plate on her door, little eyes a chain. And not too much of a crescendo on door. We want more of the crescendo on the top of page six. All right, try measure 53 to measure 60. There's a gal in Baltimore. Ready? Breathe with me. Oh, sometimes don't you just need to take like a really big breath? I do. Okay, here we go. There's, there's a gal in Baltimore, the lies a chain. Silver door plate on her door, the lies a chain. Good, do that again. Here we go. Breathe with me. There's a gal in Baltimore, little eyes a Jane. Silver door plate on her door, little eyes a Jane. Do you notice how we're kind of landing on little eyes a Jane? Little eyes a Jane. Yeah, you can do that with your head in your hand. Little No, just kidding. There's a gal in Baltimore. One more time, ready? And there's a gal in Baltimore, little eyes a Jane. Silver door plate on her door, little eyes a chain. Good. Can you back up to measure 45? So on page five. Ain't you mighty sorry? We know this. Oh my gosh. Do measure 45 to 60 with me. Ready? Middle of page five. Ain't you mighty? Ain't you mighty sorry? Ain't you mighty sorry? Goodbye, Liza. 
Eliza Jane. There's a gal in Baltimore, Eliza Jane. Silver door plate on her door, Eliza Jane. Just do that again. Again in sign language. Helper hand, dominant hand. Again. Ain't you mighty sorry? Ready, breathe with me. Ain't you mighty sorry? Ain't you mighty sorry? Goodbye, Liza Jane. There's a gal in Baltimore, Eliza Jane. Silver door plate on her door, Eliza Jane. Yes. Okay, go back to page 45. Bottom of, I'm um, sorry, back to page four, measure 37, bottom. Black my boots and make them shine. Hey, ho, the bump and roll. It sounds very similar to Charlotte Town's burning down. Hey, ho. Like I said, you almost already know this. Okay, start on measure 37. First four measures sound like this. Black my boots and make them shine. Hey, ho, the bump and roll. Do that much with me. Here we go. Ready? And black my boots and I make them shine. Hey, ho, the bump and roll. Do that again, and then we'll keep going this time. So make sure you turn the page to page five. Black my ready. Black my boots and I make them shine. Hey, ho, the bump and roll. Black my boots and I make them shine. Goodbye, Liza Jane. Do that again. Make sure to really use your articulators. We do not sing. Blah, 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 blah. No, we do not. Black my boots and make them shine. Really articulate. Ready, measure 37, bottom of page four, ready. Black my boots and make them shine. Hey, ho, the bump and roll. Black my boots and make them shine. Goodbye, Liza Jane. Keep going. Ain't you mighty sorry? Ain't you mighty sorry? Goodbye, Liza Jane. There's a gal in Baltimore, Liza Jane. Silver door plate on her door, Eliza Jane. Good. Can you go to page three, measure 21? Charlotte Town's burning down. Hey -ho. We're going to do it all. Yes. Here we go. Ready, breathe with me. Diction. No, blah, 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 blah. Wake up your mouth. Charlotte Town's burning down. And light up your eyes. Lift up your eyebrows. You got this. Charlotte Town, ready. Measure 21, bottom of page three. Ready, breathe. Charlotte Town's burning down. Hey, ho, the bump and roll. Burning down to the ground. Goodbye, Liza Jane. Ain't you mighty sorry? Ain't you mighty sorry? Goodbye, Liza Jane. Black my boots and make them shine. Hey, ho, the bump and roll. Black my boots and make them shine. Goodbye, Liza Jane. Ain't you mighty sorry? Ain't you mighty sorry? Goodbye, Liza Jane. There's a gal in Baltimore, Liza Jane. Silver door plate on her door, Liza Jane. Boom, yeah. We're going to do it. One more time, and then truly one more time, because I got to start sixth period here pretty soon. I was doing this on my lunch. Here we go, right? Because I was like, oh, we got this. Here we go. Measure 21, bottom of page three, last time through. I promise. Charlotte Town's burning down. Sorry, I thought I heard somebody walking towards my classroom, and I was like, oh, are you going to listen to me? But yeah, I'm a singer, so they're going to listen to me regardless, because I kind of sing loud. Okay, Charlotte Town's burning down. Ready, breathe with me. Last time through. Charlotte Town's burning down. Hey, ho, the bump and roll. Burning down to the ground. Goodbye, Liza Jane. Each mighty sorry. Goodbye, Liza Jane. Black my boots and I make them shine. Hey, ho, the bump and roll. Black my boots and I make them shine. Goodbye, Liza Jane. Each mighty sorry. Each mighty sorry. Goodbye, Liza Jane. There's a gal in Baltimore, Liza Jane. Silver door plate on her door, Liza Jane. Yeah. All right. So if you want a challenge. Look at measure 61 to the end of the song and see how much of that you know. Whoa, mind blown. All right, I got to go teach sixth period. Bye.